Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I just wanted to do a quick update. I'm not sure where the camera is. <laughs> I'm having to hold this with my left hand, so I think it's, I think I'm looking at you. Doesn't matter. Anyway, I'm laying here in bed with um, ice. I'm laying on a bag of frozen broccoli underneath my shoulder, and I have this bag on top, and I'm going to lay here for 20 minutes. So what happened last night, as y'all know from yesterday's video, I was in severe pain. I mean, I could, I could hardly even hold my eyes open or hold my head up. It just hurt so bad. So I called the doctor and he prescribed a, a muscle relaxer. I, I believe the name brand is Robaxin. So I took the Robaxin last night and I took the, the prednisone that was the dosage for last night. I did take two of the Tylenol uh, arthritis strength, extended relief. And I was able to sleep. I probably slept, I think I probably went to bed about <clears throat> nine or 10 and, and I slept until about four this morning. So that was a blessing for me to, to be able to get some sleep. So I got up this morning and I, um, I heated up the Epsom salt water and I put the hot compresses on it, you know, to get the muscles uh, loosened up a little bit. And then I did um, Dr. Brad and Dr. Bob stretches and LL Jean and a few more of y'all had told me about the motivational doc. So I went over to his channel and his stretch, I did it but I could only do three. Uh, it, it hurt. Uh, he has one where you clasp your hands behind your back and then you, you stretch your shoulders backwards. You know. But uh, I could only do three of those. It was just too painful. But I was able to do Dr. Brad and Dr. Bob's. Oh, and I saw another video when I was on the, the Motivational Docs channel about how to lighten the dark circles on my eyes. Um, he's got a little recipe of mixing honey and turmeric and lemon juice and tomato juice. <laughs> I have all of those items, so I may, when I get to feeling better, I'll try that underneath my eyes and see if I can lighten up the, the dark circles under my eyes. But right now, that's the least of my worries. I'm not, I'm not worried about vanity at all. I'm just worried about being able to use my right arm and regain my strength and be able to cook and take care of myself and help take care of my grandkids and, and my daughter. I know y'all think that I do too much for them, but they're my life. You know, that's what, that's what makes my life worth living. And they're the reason that I moved up north and um, they give me the motivation to wake up every morning and something to do and something to look forward to and always something to hope for. And um, to me, the, the three most important things in life are someone to love, something to do, and something to hope for. And I have all of those things with my daughter and my son and his grandkids and my my grandchildren here on Long Island. And y'all give me a lot to look forward to and, and hope for. I have really, really enjoyed reading all of your comments and y'all are just so nice to me and good to me and thoughtful and loving and considerate and I just appreciate you from the bottom of my heart. I'm gonna I'm gonna get over this. I'm gonna get better very soon. And I have got to start putting my health first above all else. I, I know that if I don't do it that I'm not going to be of any use to anybody, right? Thank you for watching and thank you for the well wishes and most of all, thank you for your love and prayers. And y'all just keep on coming back. Y'all enjoy the rest of your Sunday and have a great week ahead.